didn't get this guy from my usual place. Um, got this guy actually from uh, Robo Toy Base, I think is the name. So, uh, shout out to them. Usually ship fast and they arrive fast. I know people complain that the shipping is really expensive, but when you live in the Caribbean, the shipping is always expensive. this to the side and let's get this guy out of here box to the floor isn't that satisfying so I've always been on the fence on this guy finally decided to go ahead and get him because he looks so cool i enjoyed the megatron so much i decided to go for the optimus prime and slowly my optimus prime collection keeps growing not because i want to just because he gets a bunch of really cool toys being you know the poster child of fucking transformers uh, the cool, the, not cool, but like the interesting thing, the guy that owns Robotoy Base actually messaged me before sending this guy. He told me that other buyers have told them that this being such an old toy, the rubber tires usually get sticky. And that uh, if that would be a problem that I could cancel, I said, no, it's not a problem. To me, it's fine, personally. So I understand how it goes for, you know, things like this that are old. Let's see if you have anything funny here. Uh, open cover in front of the chest to get Matrix. Folding axe. Nice. New design for axe and gun storage. More than 400 steps of printing pro... More than 400 steps of printing process. Printing process? That is so weird. And of course, F in the comments for our poor boy Grimlock that never got made. Kind of sucks. Because uh, honestly, I enjoyed the Megatron a lot. So I'm kind of have high hopes for this guy as well. Uh, yeah. I haven't seen one of these <laughs> in a hot minute. Collector's cards that a lot of people don't care about, but I utterly adore. And it's actually really, really good. Cardstock, it feels like a... My favorite type, it feels like a credit card. Look at that. It has its own number. Alpha Pack, Civil War. That looks cool. Oh, and look, it says right here as well, more than 400 steps of printing process. That's that's just lovely. I, I love what my figures have. Printing process steps. I mean, don't you? Why are you even looking at this channel? If you don't like the printing process, which is so important to transforming toys. Jesus! All right. Get out the accessories first. Let's see the common axe, which uh, can fold in different pl places. Don't want to. There we go. That's cute. You know, I, the, the fact that it can like fold up to store. That's clever. Uh, from what I gathered, it doesn't have, like, a place to store in vehicle mode, which kind of sucks. Because the axe looks awesome. And most definitely the, the gun looks simply amazing. Looks really, really good. And it does have 
uses this to store in vehicle mode actually so that's pretty nice of course the little the little matrix that could this is small as shit it's very small gotta be careful with this because i want to put it inside the robot mode and here is mr pack himself goes to the floor and let's lower the camera Let's open this up and let's look at the wheels, see if they're sticky or slimy or anything. Let's remove this. Let's remove all of... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, those wheels are, are very disgustingly sticky. Ew. That's uh, there must be a way that you can make them unsticky. I mean, they're, they're so old, so they uh, that feels oh man, I don't know if, if you can get that in there, but you can see that the wheels they've been there for so long, they yeah, they've almost melted. Oh, that is disgusting. <laughs> that is disgusting. So if you ever buy this guy new, know that that is a hazard that could happen if you buy him. I'm guessing I'm going to have to get this guy transformed. He looks good. He looks really good. Like, I'll be honest. I, I like how he looks. I just don't like how he feels because of how sticky it is. That's ugh. So then uh, you take this and you just put this here and he holds it there and that's pretty awesome sadly no place to store this I wish you could that's just gonna mean this is gonna go to the parts bin because uh, no tabs to put this in uh, this guy's transformation isn't that complicated, so let's see if we can do it uh, in the video. Because I want to see it in robot mode. If not, I'll just, you know, you'll see the pictures at the end, I guess. So, uh, I don't like it when they, they have them in vehicle mode because for first impressions, you know, like, it's, it's just, it's a car that can barely roll because of the plastic that it has underneath and because the wheels are slimy and old that's uh yeah that's a thing that's a that's a whole thing and i think it's a little bit mistransformed as well let's see step one remove the arms and raise this part up all right look, let's take this guy off remove the arms raise up this part you okay this came off. Lower this. Lower, lower, lower. Just go to your. Uh, that might be a problem. All right. Let's see. After that, what do we do now? What's what is step three? Flip him and raise up that part. Flip him around and flip up the, the, this this part. I'm imagining this goes like this. Take this this plastic off. There we go. Much much better. Less plastic to deal with. Jesus Christ. Uh, let's see. I have no idea what any of that means. Something to do with this. Told me to press that down. I don't know why. They have to extend the legs. Nowhere does it say to extend the legs, but I'm imagining this is what you use to you press this down and then extend the legs. 
that's what it looks like. There we go. All right. The feet are probably like. Hmm. Hmm. Let me not. Let me not force anything and then end up breaking my expensive toy. So this seems like it's proper and it doesn't like stay flush, which is a bit annoying. But yeah, you know, I guess, I guess, let's put this here, check this out. Step seven, rotate, Ro rotate, really, Ro rotate, like, dude, dude, can you, can you please, can you please stop, it's, it's always, a. Uh, I, I am, are you sure it's like this? I don't think so. Ugh, so, so, this, this, this is so, bleh. Let me check, like, the, the, these instructions are not, are not complete. I mean, like, are you surprised it's a third-party product? Just so scared of putting any pressure into it, you know? I don't want to end up breaking something. There we go. Just have to do that. And yep. You, you didn't even see what I did. I mean. All right. So it was here and I untapped it and then did this. And then that sounds terrifying. That Jesus. Take the wheel. There we go. That taps in there. Okay. Then these actually do. You have to force them out. Just again, this this thing is so old that. There we go. Look, it kind of has like a gear walk mode. And I don't get it because the back wheels are not sticky. It's only that one. All right. Seems to me that we're done with this side. So now let's see what we have to do with this side and the upper side. So that's to push this inside. I don't know how, but you know. There we go. Let's do Move this here, move this here, and move this like this, and there we go. It's a interesting tab. Imagine the exhaust ports go to the outside of the hands. My dude, please, please stand up. I mean, stay standing. Yes, I was correct. And then you open these up. Is he like bending forward? Yes, he is. Oh man, these these poor old figures. I feel so bad for them. They look so good, but you know, <laughs> not much you can do about them when they're this old. The thing is, like, this guy looks awesome, to me at least. Put this out. Put this out, right? And then put this back here. We're, we're, we're getting there. We are definitely getting there. Let me check these again. 
Yeah, you, you put that in there. And then, oh, okay, you have to open up. You have to open this up. Because this thing goes like this. And then, wait, what? This thing goes like this. This. This way. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, I'm doing something weird. I'm doing something weird. Oh, there we go. There, there, there. There you go. We got it. We got it. We got it. This. Okay, so that's weird. This tab's up here. And it has a stress mark already, which is frightening. Uh, but that that's it. That's it. Doesn't really tab anywhere. This like just remains like that precariously. There we go. And there we have it. Let's see if we can open up the the compartment for the matrix. We can put it in there. I don't have any fingernails. And that's why we have tools. That's why we have to. Where are my spudgers? There we go. See? Easy. Easy. Let's get this open. And just slide it off up here. No, no, this is extremely wrapped. Watch me unbox toys and struggle with them. That's what happens when the damn things are not packaged in robot mode. So I prefer them because that way I can just give you my honest opinion of the robot itself, which is honestly the main form right it's what most people buy them for i buy them because i like the transformations but mostly you know robot modes there we go that's that's nice that's nice fits in there pretty well he stands well he stands fine i i mean the only issue here the only real issue here is the the slimy, not slimy, the atrociously sticky wheels. Atrociously. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> I like the head sculpt. It's kind of cute. I do. I, I actually do, do, do like it a lot. Just, he feels like he's, like... Bending forward all the in time. You like stand. There we go. All right, so we're gonna do one click and then one click. And then two clicks, I guess, for this one. Because you're not. I don't feel I don't feel you I don't feel your feet cooperating my dude one one I don't feel your feet really wanting to cooperate I can see why I saw some reviews and uh, some reviewers were saying that uh, the Spartan the Megatron was way better than this one I can see why Well, at least he holds his gun well. Now, I'll be honest, I like, I really like how he looks. Just, it feels like he's not standing straight. That, 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 that's my issue. He, he feels like he's not, not really standing straight. And it's, it's weird. It feels weird. 
I mean, he feels great in hand, except for ugh. You, you, you can see it right on the camera how shiny it is. That's because it's sticky. That's disturbing. But I like them. All in all, I'm happy I got them finally. This his head is very, very limited. If you could like look upwards a little bit more, and still like, does he look like he's bending forward to you? Because he feels like he's bending forward to me. And now my bench is all sticky because of the wheels. That just disturbs me, man. It just disturbs me. Yeah, you, you, you are dying to fall, aren't you? You are dying to fall to the floor. Probably can tighten these up. Probably going to have to tighten those up. And he can hold his gun that well either. That's a damn shame, dude. That's a damn shame. Just going to pose this guy carefully and slowly. I hope he doesn't fall. <laughs> Thanks for joining me. I'm sorry that this went on for so long. See you guys next time.